everything from up here. It beats walking, that's for sure. The best way to see NLA. I never get tired of this view. It's like a different city every time. It's certainly come a long way in the last few weeks. There's still so much to be done. One day at a time. Speaking of which, we don't really have time for a full pleasure cruise here. Why don't you give us the express tour, Lynn? Just the highlights. Okay, you got it. <clears throat> New LA is divided into four districts. We departed from the industrial district, where Doug and I were conducting the flight test. It has food production, scale development, you know, industries and stuff. It's also where the West Gate is located, remember? Expect to pass through there fairly often. The only other gate out of the city is in the administrative district. I'm skipping ahead. <clears throat> Next is the commercial district. Restaurants, galleries, cafes, clothing, groceries, you name it. It's a veritable shopping paradise. The CD is the closest thing to a downtown we've got. It can actually get pretty crowded sometimes. Well, by NLA standards anyway. Day or night, the best and only bargains on the planet. To your right, the residential district. Housing, housing, and more housing. Well, plus a nice park and the cathedral. If you're ever looking for quiet time alone, want to relax and unwind with a good book, that's the spot. Right? The park is my favorite place to just zone out and chill. And last but not least, our destination, the Administrative District, the nerve center at the heart of NLA. Note the distinct dual-level structure here. The upper level holds our Administrative Tower, home to Blade HQ and the government. Not to mention Armory Alley, as well as the barracks where we live. The lower level there is a hangar complex for scale maintenance and repairs. And this concludes our tour. We will be landing shortly. Thanks, Lynn. We'll save the rest of orientation for once we're back at the barracks. <laughs> <laughs>